Okay, we're here at 8340 Rosewood Avenue here in Los Angeles. Now, we're here to check the main sewer line. We obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. You'll have your general inspector crawl underneath the house. He's physically going to look at everything. We're here to check the main line, and this inspection is based on my opinion. So I can tell you we're running the camera from this 4-inch clean-out located here by the carport, and we're all the way out to the city connection in the street. Now, if you look at about 4 o'clock there, there's a little bit of roots there in the line coming into the pipe. And what's happening, there is a cured-in-place pipe lining over here. And uh, what I can tell you is that these linings don't really stop roots from growing. Now, those roots are very minor anyway, but the linings do not stop roots from growing. And um, this doesn't really look like a legal lining anyway for the city of Los Angeles. Uh, but um, you can see it is functioning, except at the end of the line there are roots. Now, one thing for certain, you should never uh, run a cable with a blade through a lining because you can damage it. The only way that these roots could be really cleaned out is with a hydro jetter, uh, very carefully. So, uh, um, because you don't want to, the hydro jetter splashes backwards and eventually it's going to break the end of the lining anyway. So it is functioning. Uh, there's no telling how long the lining will last for, um, but it is functioning, and eventually it's going to break down. Now, we're coming onto the property over here. You can see a lot of water flowing by. We're going to change to an ABS plastic pipe and a polyethylene pipe, which is this is all in good condition. It's nice and clean as it runs all the way through the driveway. You can see a polyethylene pipe there. You can see how it bends. Now, they're running a lot of water through the line, so you can see it's actually flowing very well. Now, this is the only clean-out available to us, so what we'll probably do is we'll probably try to jump up on the roof and just run through a roof fence so we can see what the pipe looks like from the house up to this clean out. We come out of the clean out over here. We're going to go ahead and pause the recording. Okay, so we're running a camera from a roof vent. Uh, we're doing that because we like to check as much of the main line as possible. And because the clean out was so far away from the house, we got up on the roof to run the camera from a roof vent so we could confirm that it's all ABS plastic. And it is. We're pretty much past the clean-out now outside as we bring our camera back. This is outside of the house. This is by the clean-out right outside, right over there. That's the outside clean-out. So beyond that point, we've already checked everything. So now we're coming underneath the concrete slab of the driveway. All ABS plastic, it's all in good condition. We always recommend that you never flush tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. So now we're pretty much underneath the house now. Just confirm that everything under the foundation, everything underneath the house, and everything outside of the house, all ABS plastic and polyethylene pipe. The cured in place pipe lining looked like it was in good condition, except there are roots getting in at the end of it. Because like I mentioned, linings do not stop roots from growing. And you do have these ficus trees over here that are quite aggressive. And, uh, but it is functioning. However, linings don't stop roots from growing. So let's bring the camera up through the roof vent now. Okay, clean up the lens. Okay, here we are on top of the roof, and we'll go ahead and stop the recording over here.